Hey everyone, Jamie Thurber here, and I want to make a quick video to talk about ways to keep your um, motivation and your positive attitude going through your PMS time of the month. Um, I know that it's a big, it can be a big factor to a lot of women and it can really cause a lot of issues um, and cause them to just really be down for that week and not be nearly as productive as they want to be. And sometimes it lasts longer than a week. I've had a lot of clients, you know, and friends and family members as well tell me, oh, I can't this week, you know, I, I just have no energy or I just feel so terrible. And I have really bad symptoms of, of PMS as well on a monthly basis, so I totally understand. And it's a constant battle for me every month to remember to implement these things into my own daily life so that I don't let that week make me unproductive and me get behind. So um, here are just some tips for you. Now, this is not medical advice by any means, so if you're having severe um, PMS and, and those type of issues, you just should go see your doctor. Um, this is just really ways to keep you positive and motivated and energetic um, during the week when you're feeling really drained um, by things you really can't control. So um, unfortunately, we can't control that part of our lives, So, um, but we can control the way that we adapt to it and the way we let it um, change our habits for that week or um, our reaction, I should say. So the first thing I'm going to talk about is staying active. Um, this is really hard for me because I'm a huge baby whenever I don't feel good. I'm very pouty and I don't want to do anything. But I have to remember, like, I, ha I still have things to do. I still have to go, you know, conquer the world today. And so remembering, to, remembering that and pushing yourself mentally to get up and be active. Um, take a walk, do your morning workout, do some yoga, some stretching, do something that's going to get that blood pumping, um, get you moving. Not only does that help amp up your energy levels for the day and, and actually it decreases the pain typically if you're having cramps, that helps a lot if you work through them and it really seizes, seizes that uh, pain level. Another thing it helps with is, is your sadness and anxiety. So if you're feeling super emotional, a lot of times working out like that, it really, really helps keep those um, emotions in check. So I do yoga in the mornings most of the time anyway um, On when I'm feeling really crappy. Sometimes I'll just do some really intense like stretching videos. I have some people that I follow on YouTube. I sh uh, save their videos and those are the ones that I use. I just usually pick somebody that I resonate really well with um, and save their stuff and that's what I use in the mornings. If you're interested or you want some advice on people or some uh, suggestions, email me and I will send you the people that I follow and you can check them out. Um, next thing would be to really think about what you're thinking about. We have so many thoughts going through our head on a daily basis that most of the time we really don't pay attention to what we're thinking. And we can easily think ourselves into a terrible mood. We can easily think ourselves into the most negative hole that you can imagine without even realizing that we're doing it, especially when we're PMSing and we're super emotional. Don't use that as an excuse. Don't let it make you feel that way. Really be conscious of what you're thinking and turn it around. Keep those negative thoughts out of your head really, really mo focus on that motivation mindset a lot more this week. Um, I hear people tell me all the time, oh, I hate being a girl. It sucks. Actually, being a woman is pretty freaking awesome. And sure, that's one of the consequences we have of being born as a girl. But it, I mean, it is what it is. Think about, think if you go, I mean, you can think forever about the reason that it happens and how amazing that is and, you know, whatever. But being a woman's amazing own it like own it do not be that girl who's like oh my period i can't i can't function today use your mindset to think about what you can do that day um say you know what i'm gonna get up and i'm gonna do all of these things i'm gonna keep thinking i don't feel and then you get that the feeling and you're like oh, i feel like crap this sucks take five minutes sit by yourself even if you don't have five minutes take a couple minutes do deep breathing exercises, take deep breaths, close your eyes, visualize that you want to feel better, visualize how you can keep your frame of mind where it needs to be, visualize what you can do, sorry my doggies are in here, visualize what you can do to keep your 
frame of mind up and and where it needs to be for you to be a powerhouse even when you don't feel good no one else needs to know that you're PMSing no one else needs to know that you don't feel well so um, that is the tip when it comes to mindset another thing I like to talk about is being prepared um, I have a big issue with cramps and especially when I was working in the corporate world and I had my little cubicle I would take a heating pad with me to work um, for sure so that I wasn't miserable all day I was totally prepared for what I knew was going to be coming and because typically we know how we're gonna feel so be prepared for it pack extra food if you need it or pack different snacks I'm really nauseous most of the time so I'll pack a different type of snack than I normally would so just really be prepared um, don't again just don't let it run your life that week or stop you from being productive um, another thing is make sure you sleep enough give your body the rest that it needs you need to fuel your body with food and let your body recoup through sleeping so really make sure that that week you're not over pushing yourself that you allow yourself to sleep and I think it'll make a big difference um, so yeah that's really what I just had to talk about today I just hear so many people talking about it and I think that maybe this these tips would be helpful for some women so I thought I would jump in here and record them real fast um, I'd love your feedback let me know what you think or if you have other tips that you um, use that work for you I'd love to share them um, with people so you can comment below or you can email me directly at jamie at posh promo stl.com um, or you can visit my website which is jamie um, and until next time have a great day everyone